All right, guys, let's go check out Gabriel and see how he's doing. Gabe, wakey, wakey. Uh-oh. Oh, we're going to go take a look at him. Oh, boy. How's Gabe doing? Well, he's looking a little green under the gills there. Hair looking a little greasy. Oh, yeah, give him a little TLC there, Grace. Grace? I'm right here. I fucked up. <coughs> I know. Well, you're mildly. It's okay. It's not okay. Not even close. How'd you find me anyway? I ordered a deed of entitlement to issue to the Black Wolf. It came in yesterday. Oh, and God. And Glower's name was on it. I threatened oh. Werner Huber's life unless he told me where you were. Yeah, well... <laughs> unfortunately, your cavalry arrived too late this time. Well, if you hadn't been such an idiot refusing to tell me where you were, I might have been able to save your little butt days ago. Well, maybe I'd rather have it chewed off than have to deal with your gloating. You ever think of that? <laughs> He's doing great. <laughs> oh, jeez. We have to deal with things the way they are. Do you remember what you kept talking about on the way over here? That vision of Ludwig? Yeah. Believe it or not, it may help us out. I'm gonna go check on some things. Mr. Smith will watch over you, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. I think Gabriel might be dying. Well, he did get bit by a werewolf, so, you know. He's got the lichenism pouring through his veins there, Gracie. And we learned a lot right there. Gabriel would rather be dead than let Grace gloat over him. Oh, jeez. Uh, do we have anything that can maybe, I don't know, reach a pigeon? No, no, I, I don't think we do, unfortunately. So, we're gonna have to get a little creative. Let's go in here and ask someone, anyone, about our predicament. Werner looks about as interested in talking to me as I am in talking to him. <laughs> he feels pretty bad about Gabriel. <laughs> and if only he hadn't been so stubborn we might be able to save gabriel now i'm not so sure i think i think gabriel might be toast guys sit down grace oh we got lots of dialogue options here okay we can deal with this this is really, really nice. Gabriel seems awfully sick. Of course he does. His body's fighting that blood something fierce. You know, dear, I wouldn't count on Gabriel being pleasant or even cooperative. He is quite literally not himself. You think I shouldn't really let it bother me that he's being such a butthead? Well, don't worry, <laughs> he's always like that. It will get worse. Do you think that we really need to keep him locked up in there? It seems so cruel. He'll be more at ease knowing he's locked up in there and can't harm anyone if he does change. I suppose so. His only chance now is the destruction of his maker. Oh, no. I know. Oh, that's pretty heavy. Okay. Um. God, that's, that's going to take some doing, fam. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right, I guess let's do it, man. Emil will watch over Gabriel in the dungeon? Yes, dear. Besides, you have other things to attend to, don't you? Yes. The opera. And the diagram. I have to get them. Do you think you'll be able to do that by yourself? Just watch me. Well, she's gonna have to. It's gonna take some good old-fashioned grace ingenuity, and God knows she's got a lot of it. Do you know anything about El Totting? Yes, it's a pilgrimage shrine. Emil and I have been there, but I didn't know about the hard urns at the time. It's one of those places that 
vibrates with spiritual energy. It's very strong. I think they had the first miracle in, oh, about the middle of the 1700s. But the Black Madonna herself is much older than that. Now you be careful. I'll try my best, but I don't promise anything. I mean, Gabriel's willing to put himself in harm's way, and honestly, well, Grace is a little smarter than that. Is she willing to put herself in harm's way? Well... She did get kidnapped by the voodoo cartel in the previous game, and it was almost a sacrifice in that one, so we'll say maybe. She can't give me any more advice now. Hmm. Yeah, I guess she's tapped, isn't she? That's tough. What about this guy? Does he have anything for me? Mayor Habermas probably has his hands full today. Hey, is he the one watching over Gabriel, or is someone else watching over Gabriel? Or is like, was it her, uh, the old lady's husband was watching over Gabriel? I don't know, I can't keep track of anything. Make sure we don't have any postage for us. Grüß Gott, Frau Nakimura. Grüß Gott. Haben Sie etwas für mich? Nicht für Sie, aber für den Schattenjäger. For Gabriel, oh, what is it? Oh, oh, we do have mail. Oh. Oh. Holy, oh shit. Oh, okay. I'll take it to him. Well, ich bringe es zu ihm, okay? Take it to him. Yeah. Okay. See, she's afraid for the shot in Jaeger too. The entire town of Rittersburg is very concerned. And for good reason. They know that the man's been bitten by a werewolf. Oh boy. Oh, it's from Von Glauer. Look at that, man. Oh boy. Oh man. Where is he? Mengfallstrasse? Uh, 800? I don't know what that says. It's a letter from Von Glauer, and he sent the Ritter talisman back, too. Oh, God. Gabriel, I know you are very ill right now. The change is always painful. I went through it myself when I was only 12, and I did not even know what was happening to me. I'm sorry I'm not there to help you, but I have a pretty clear sense that you would not welcome my presence. You are safe in Rittersburg. For now, that is enough. Let me speak then of the future. You hate me now. I know this. But I have some hope that by the pass of the second moon, when the sickness wanes and the blood has inflamed the greater part of you, you will see things differently. Oh boy. There's more. There's a lot more. Oh. <laughs> you will need me then, and I think you will want me then. It is for hope of this that I did not have you destroyed the night you were bitten by Bonsell. I could have done. You were passed out for hours at the lodge. It would have been a simple thing to wake the men. Show them Bonsal's corpse and make up a story that would enrage them enough to kill you. I did not. Thanks. Let that be proof of my true desire for friendship with you. I have desired companionship for more years than you have lived. Oh, is that how this is going? Um, I don't know if Gabriel's interested in that kind of relationship, to be honest, though. I don't know Gabriel that well, personally. We have to ask and find out. I have even very rarely taken the risk and changed others. But the blood was always too much for the brain and my chosen one ended up dead. Or mad. This is why I started the Hunt Club. It was my idea that if I could first indoctrinate men's minds to the religion of tooth and claw, that they then might be prepared for the change. As you have seen, it did not work. Monsell was the best of the lot. If he had turned out well, I would have taken the others. But there's no point in even trying with them now. 
God, Von Zell was the best. Boy, that really worked out well, didn't it? But you are different. You are a Ritter. Your blood is already supernatural. Yes, I know of your family. I have studied much over these long years. When we met, I felt somehow that you would not be destroyed by the gift. You have an enormous streak of the beast in you. And you are innately strong in the occult. You will be powerful and beautiful in the change. I am sure of it. I did not intend for it to happen so soon and in such a way. But perhaps fate has its own reason. But how confused you must be. You may feel I used you to dispose of Montel. I did. Oh, boy. Cool. I'm glad to be of service. <laughs> Thank you for not telling all those guys that wild story that you just told me about. I'm glad to be alive, I, I think. Um, yeah. He had to be taken care of and you obligingly showed up. What was I to do? I'm too old not to have learned at least this much about the light. You cannot shut it out. Better to let it in and let it simply dim to adjust to the relative brightness inside. Think well on these things, as your body adjusts. Think about meeting me in Munich in two months' time. Months? We can leave Germany if you wish, and go anywhere you like. I will teach you how to hunt, how to live safe and well. God, this is a hell of a way to start a relationship, Von Glauer. You can feel the night wind on your face, taste the heartbeat of the kill beneath your jaws. It is glorious. Much more so than the priestly lie the Schattenjäger offers. Don't confuse yourself with ideas of good and evil. Nature shows us that there are no such distinction. You and I both inherited something from our fathers. Is your legacy any less of a curse or blessing than mine? Join me. Yours, Friedrich. Did I hear the priestly life of a Schottenjäger? Um, I'm not sure if Frederick here is really acquainted with the life of a Schottenjäger. I'll have him know about one dreamboat Wolfgang that had a girlfriend half his age. In fact, we might go talk to her right now. A priestly life. <laughs> is that what they say? I'm pretty sure that if Gabriel were interested... The lilies died after all. Oh, Oh. That's a bad omen. Oh dear. Somehow I get the feeling that if Gabriel were so interested, like, he could kind of have his pick of the litter in Rittersburg. Zombies, are you ready for some werewolf action? Are you ready for some werewolf action tonight? Because tonight we're going to get some werewolf action, some HWA. Your body is ready. God, I hope Gabriel's is. <laughs> oh, we got a lot to do first. Let's go this way. Did she actually go someplace? No, she didn't go anywhere. That sweet, sweet werewolf action, baby. Let's go talk to Gerda. Got places to go. Things to do. How is Gabriel? Is he going huh? to be alright? No. <laughs> He's really not. He's in so much trouble. He'll be fine, Gerda. Well, that's bullshit. <laughs> Let me know if I can help. Sure. Thanks. Come on, do you buy that, Gerda? Oh, she don't buy that. You can see by her face, she don't buy that at all. Hey, Gerda's not dumb. She knows what's up. Gerda's offered to help, but I can't think of anything she can do at the moment. I mean, she knows Schottenjäger stuff. She's not, like, completely ignorant. You can probably ask her for something. Gerda's offered... Alright, there's nothing in here. 
Anglauer. Anglauer. God. Zombies, how you been since I saw you earlier during Demon Souls? Oh, wait, what's this? Well, that looks important. What's that? Clean sheets? Did you wet the bed, Gracie? It's okay. What? I don't have time to put the rest of the sheets on the bed. Nice view of the Alps. She gave us fresh sheets. She trying to tell us something? You've been sleeping in Gabriel's bed. You need to change the sheets. I think the time for research has passed. Yeah, I kind of agree. Uh... I get the feeling we're going to have to write a note to Von Glauer or something. Send him a nice invitation. I don't have time for that today. Yeah. Oh. I don't... The weird laugh? Yeah, I did it. I wonder if Gabriel will ever write again. <laughs> we can only hope not. Oof. Ooh, soon, Grace. He's already wishing his writing the absolute worst. Well, I guess Gabriel did bring that on himself, didn't he? Yeah. I mean, he did call her Fujitsu in the novel, so I can imagine why she might not be too thrilled about him continuing his, uh, uh, work. I guess we'll call it that. Alright, so we got the talisman, and we got, like, the car keys. We should probably put the talisman on Gabriel, right? I mean, he is a Ritter, and he is a Schottenjäger. So if he doesn't have the talisman around his neck, then... How is he supposed to shotten his Jaegers? Open her up, Grace. Let's go. Who knows? Maybe I'll do it again tonight. I don't know, I only do it at specific times, like... Alright, I guess the, the psychic lady's husband is watching him. Probably for the best, because he knows what's up. I only do it at specific times when something, like, dumb happens, or whatever. I don't know. Oh, a pillowcase! Wait, can we use that to get the birdie? God, I don't know why we want a pigeon, but I, I kind of want a pigeon. Alright, Gabriel, I got something for you. You're gonna love this. I'll keep the talisman until Gabriel's better. It might not react well to that stuff in his blood. No. No, that's fair enough. I guess I understand that. Uh, what if we use a pillowcase and grab the birdie? I can't reach the bird through the bars. Is there like a step ladder or something you can grab? I don't know. Damn, how you doing, man? How you been since I saw you last? Hope life is treating you good. Tonight we're gonna watch someone get hungry like the wolf. Mm, and I can hardly wait. Earlier we had some we had a lot of fun playing Dark Souls. Or not Dark Souls, Demon Souls. I decided to play like an idiot and <laughs> I did fisticuffs only. <laughs> no armor and fisticuffs. What a dumpster fire of a playthrough that was. God. I beat the first boss, and that's about all I beat. <laughs> I had to get real creative during that fight. Ugh. But I had fun, it was a good time. <laughs> Alright, let's go inside the castle and see... Ooh, 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 ooh. We need to remember, like, where all the map pieces are in this place. Um... Doing alright, had issues with your Wi-Fi since yesterday until earlier today. Oh, really? I'm sorry to hear that. Well, I'm glad they're resolved, more or less, now. Is this the mo famous poutine stream you've heard so much about? I'm afraid not, Chozo. I still need 15 more subs for that to happen, my friend. Fifteen more big ones, and then we will poutine the place up. We will get so Canadian, this stream will be plastered with maple flags. We'll get so Canadian, 
America will kick me out. I will no longer be a man who puts ketchup on his fries, but vinegar instead. <laughs> I'll be a man who eats all dressed chips every day. Uh. Okay, I can see how this might be a problem. We might have to get creative in this place. I refuse poutine milkshake. Ah, uh, yes, I, I kind of do refuse poutine milkshake. If I drink a poutine milkshake, I, I'm afraid I won't be able to keep it down. I am afraid of poutine. <laughs> poutine deeply terrifies me. By the way, uh, th thanks for that, Jim. Jim, how were the levels on that? Were that, were that, was that loud enough? Out of curiosity? Or do I need to, like, turn it up a little bit? Because I've been trying to play around with the levels to get it just right. Uh, because everything was, like, too loud when I was listening to one of the bods. That was good for you? Okay, well, if it's good for you, then we'll... We'll, we'll, we'll say it's just fine, then. Just making sure it's good for you. Oh yeah, I have better Twitch TV emotes, guys, so if you install the extension on your browser, uh, you get access to like 24 extra emotes right now. I, I have the ability to put 50 up, but I just haven't found time to put more than that up. Well, I've got like 26 now, I think. So we do have many more emotes than what you see here if you install better Twitch TV. And we have kebab mote. I don't see why not, so yeah, what the hell. Let me see here. Oh, we got lots of different ones. Oh, okay. Uh, God, there's lots of different ones. Here, I'll put the animated one up. There. <laughs> there you go. I put it on, Chozo. See, I had the foresight to keep better Twitch TV open while I'm doing this. <laughs> no regrets. Enjoy yourself. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad you're having fun, Chozo. <laughs> These all say Maria hat gehelfen, Mary helped. That's right, we gotta go to this church and we gotta get uh, the heart of Ludwig. I can't believe we're gonna steal a dude's heart, but I guess that's what we're doing. This game is uh, getting pretty metal right now. These all say. You're hotboxing this room? Dude, Chozo, how much weed have you had today? Also, did you eat your burgers yet, bro? Also, did you enjoy the Demon Souls, uh, the Demon Souls stream? There were a couple of really nice clips from that stream that Bleh Bleh Freak and uh, Zombies did, and uh, I, I threw them up on YouTube. Well, they're gonna be published tomorrow, but I sent them on. I sent them on over there. Demon Souls, God, that was fun, even if it like made me a little mad sometimes. <laughs> Fist, fisty cuffs only. I'm an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Silver body parts. Oh God. Weird. Penitent offerings. A replica is made for the part of the body you wish to have healed. The replica is offered to the Lady of Altading as a token of faith. That's a little weird. I'm not gonna lie. AJ, how you doing? Good to see you, AJ. I hope that you're doing well since I saw you just a few hours ago. And, uh... God, I'm glad you're here, bro. AJ, you've been joining me for, like, everything recently. I really appreciate that. <laughs> I should have another character and play the game with a weapon and enjoy it. I do enjoy it. What, you don't think I enjoy playing with fisticuffs? This is how I play games. Uh, I, I play away, I play, I like to play games in the way that they weren't intended, I guess. 
that's why when you give me a game, you gotta make it like this one, where I can't I can't go off the rails with stuff. But of course, with a Sierra game, sometimes they give me a lot more options, but not Gabriel Knight 2. I'm a little bit on rails with this one. Uh, thanks, Jim. Hope you're having fun with that unhinged Batman. God, I love that emote. That's like one of my favorite emotes. <laughs> I, I remember I took a screenshot of that from Batman Returns and just went to town on it. God, it was actually really hard to get just the right frame in Batman Returns and find that. Where Michael Keaton was making that insane face and it was glorious. Jozo wants me to play through Dark Souls or Demon Souls normally. Dozo's just sitting on the other side of his computer, like, pounding on his keyboard saying, Why don't you just play it normally? Stop doing stupid things. Why are you playing Resident Evil 4 like this? Why are you playing, <laughs> Why are you playing Soulsborne games like this? <laughs> just, just play it normally, you idiot. <laughs> I suppose the crosses are gifts from the cured. Or are they another means of petitioning the lady? I mean, your guess is as good as mine, Gracie. I'm not Catholic. I'm not even religious. I got no idea what to say about this stuff. To me, this is just all, I don't know, kind of weird. You want Dark Souls 1 playthrough, 5 Estus run? Isn't that just a base run? Um, I actually don't know. Isn't that just like the, the very base level character? These all say Maria hat gehelfen. Mary helped. Mary helped. Oh, yep. Yeah. Catholic. Yeah. Hello. Ah, uh, hello, Friar. And level up and use whatever, but no kindling bonfires. Oh, is that what it is? Okay. So what you're saying is I'm just going to start at the same bonfire if I die the whole time. Oh. God. That really is a whole plate of suffering, isn't it? I don't know about that one. Dark Souls 1 is already... I don't know. It's already hard enough. <laughs> oh, you can rest at them. Okay. Oh, I can't upgrade them. Oh, that's right. I forgot about that. I forgot you had to upgrade the bonfires in Dark Souls. I always forget that stuff. Mary's water. It looks like they want a donation. Well, fork over some Mun Mun there, Grace. I'm to buy some holy water. God, this stuff is probably filthy, but they probably just got it from a toilet or something. Chateau of Mary. I would like to have a word. Is it possible to see Ludwig's heart earn? Das tut mir leid. Das Herz für Ludwig des Weiter von Bayern. Haben Sie das Herz? Das Herz. Herz. Oh, no, not my heart. I'm not sick. Thanks. This man does not understand a word she said. Ah, well, it was a good effort there, Gracie. Yeah, let's just plow through here. I'd better wait until the service is over. Oh, just keep going. Just interrupt the service. They'll forgive you, honest. All right, I guess she doesn't want to do that. She'll never go for it. What does this thing say, anyway? If you have a special prayer to make or wish to place a penitence offering, I can lead you to the shrine. Oh, wait, this guy just has cards? Oh, he's one of these dudes that took a vow of silence, isn't he? Okay, um, we might need to... Here, let's try clicking that on him and see what he says. 
I have a prayer for the Madonna, Father. Oh, he's going to check on the service, isn't he? Yeah, there it is. Uh... Oh, he wants to know the You'll time. Take me when the service is over. Oh, well, that's that's what he meant. Yes, Father. I thought he wanted to know the time. God, pointing at her watch. It's all this nonverbal communication. Throw me for a loop. Hey, where 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 are we? Oh, we're at the. Okay. I better wait till the service is over. Yeah, I guess I saw that coming. All right, Ooh, I've got a plan here. Let's try doing something with. What we got here. We've got a little holy water. All right, if we can use Mary's water, I think I know what I need to do here. Let's go back to Ludwig's castle and wreak a little mayhem, shall we? Ah, yes. This is going to be good. Hmm. There'll be none the wiser. Hmm. Oh, wait, I can't... Well, I can't pour water on this? Well, let me pour water on it. Oh, they're really not going to play ball with this one, are they? Well, maybe I need different supplies before I can do certain things. Hmm. As I recall, there's like one... There's one piece of the opera in that other room. And then there's another piece of the opera... Oh! Oh, wait. Well, that's unexpected. You better get off the chair. Oh, they don't like that. Oh, that's a naughty, naughty thing to do. Whoopity putting your shoes all over, all over historical artifacts. What a shame. Oh, and look what we're about to do with a historical artifact. All right, Grace. Yeah, oh, God. Oh, look what she did. It's ruined. Oh, there's gonna be so much mold there. Oh, that's a good one, Grace. Oh, she got it good. All right, cool. Oh, it's so cool. All right, let's go in here. Yeah. What we got in here, baby? I think we got one piece of an opera. Grab that piece, Gracie. Get that piece. Yeah, yeah, there it is. Oh, look at that. Culture in the palm of your hand. The Lost Wagner. Yeah, don't handle it too hard. That's really, really old. <laughs> it's like, God, that's gotta be at least 100 years old, bro. Wait, Wagner died in what, 1883 or something? Yeah, it's like 110 years old by the point of this game. Oh, hey, look who it is. Absolutely nothing weird going on here. I don't here. think I need to move the table. No, you you don't. I don't think... Well, where, where, where are we uh, clicking here? Oh, wait, we're clicking there. Okay. So we got map, or we got opera piece, rather, number two. She's finding the false wall. She's feeling. She's, she's, and she found it. Look at Grace go. Oh my God, this woman is resourceful. I love Grace. Gabriel, you don't deserve her. Gabriel, you need to marry this woman. This woman's too good for you. All right, that's two opera pieces. I need a third one now. I have a funny feeling we're not going to get it. Until we do something else, though. 
I doubt there's anything left in there now. Nah, there's nothing left in there. That's okay. I know where the third act is. I think. And... God, look at... Where, where, which place could it be in? I... Hmm... I don't think the guards would be sympathetic to my cause. Yeah, probably not. I mean, you are looking for lost map pieces in the castle. Kind of a wonder that they're still here, to be honest. Or not lost map pieces. Why do I keep wanting to call them a that map piece? That adjoining hallway might be useful. I keep wanting to call them map pieces, but they're not map pieces. They're opera pieces. There is something I cannot do here yet. I think... I think I need to go back to Rittersburg. Briefly. Yeah. And I think we're gonna try to steal a pigeon. God, this is silly. I'm gonna steal a pigeon. I think I'll steal one of these rolls. Please do, dear. You're thin as a rail. No oh, way, that's what I had to do? I had to take a roll from the dinner table? That's it? I don't need another roll. Grace Nakamura. Okay, well, if we got that, I guess let's go back into the dungeon and let's uh, get that pigeon that we were talking about. I need a pigeon in my pocket. I know this is an FMV game, I know it's supposed to be realistic, but I'm, I need a live animal in my p inventory, in my pocket, or I'm just not playing an adventure game. I mean, think about Monkey Island, you had a monkey and a dog in your pocket for most of the game. Well, that's not true, I had a dog for a little while, and then I had a monkey, but still, I had a monkey the whole time. <sighs> All right, Birdie, come on over here. Yeah, this looks tasty, doesn't it? Mmm, I bet you're hungry. Yeah, yeah. Lay out some crumbs. Yeah, Birdie likes that. Can't believe the bird is still here. Yeah, I'll meet up. Mmm, oh, it's tempting. Bird can't resist. There it comes. Yeah. Alright, I think we got this now. Let's use our handkerchief because we don't want to get our hands all filthy because it is uh it is a dirty, dirty bird. Or you can just use your bare hands there, Gracie. Um never mind me. <laughs> Boy, that kinda defeats the purpose of the handkerchief. Supposed to keep your hands right. clean, girl. You're just gonna help me out for a bit, and then you'll be free. Look at her, she just stuffed a pigeon in her trench coat. <laughs> this, is, this is a very reasonable thing to do. <laughs> what do you think if you saw someone stuffing a pigeon in their trench coat in real life? Ah, if I saw someone stuffing a pigeon in the trench coat in real life, I might freak out a little bit. I might call the police. <laughs> oh, jeez. Well, let's go back to the castle and let's 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 have some fun. Got a pigeon in our trench coat. I think it needs to be set free. And I think I've got just the place to set it free. Ah, that's better. God. I've been drinking some 
a lot of water recently. I felt pretty dehydrated. I don't feel too bad right now, but... I'm not gonna lie, the bottoms up redeem from earlier felt pretty nice. But it's been so hot recently. Today it was like 80 something while I was streaming and thankfully I didn't feel it that much. It was a little bit hotter tonight than it did the past, uh, the past week or so. Because tonight it is 71. Alright, let's take this pillar. Let's take this pigeon. Let's set it free. Yeah, big empty hall in there and nothing to do. Well, pigeon, this hall is yours now. Do whatever you will with it. Grace, let's, let's just just let it out. You got a whole pigeon in your... Yeah, there. There you go. Alright, birdie. Um... God. What do you think the odds are that that pigeon pooped inside her jacket? Well, it looks pretty calm, to be honest. You guys know that the window is just kind of open, right? Like, you can just, any bird can just fly in anytime they want. Are they really surprised by this? Eh. Well, anyway, while he's distracted, we'll take care of business. Ahem. And time for that last piece, Gracie. Ooh, I think this is the last piece. I think there's only three acts. But seriously, bro, this, uh, the opera got, excuse me, the opera nerd we know had to specify. He's going to lose it when he sees what I have for him. Oh, oh, oh. All right, mission accomplished. Feel good about yourself. Yeah, you got a pigeon, bro. Good job. I think the funniest possible thing would be if he threw it out and it flew back in. <laughs> Why does she look so distraught that he threw away her pigeon? What, does she have a bonding moment with it? I guess it was kind of a nice pigeon. I mean, especially if it didn't poop inside of her jacket while it was in tow. Well, anyway, we got our, uh, uh, we got our pieces, so that's pretty cool. Let's go back over here and... Yeah, there's nothing left to do over there. That tracks. Um, let's go back over here and see if we can make a petition for prayer. Ah, uh, I thought it was going to be quieter than it is. It is not quiet at all. I'd better wait till the service is over. Yeah. All right, service is not over, so let's uh, get on out of here. Let's go back to Rittersburg. I thought that the service might be over, but I was dead wrong about that. And has offered to. Um. Are, are, God, are you sure you don't want to talk to Gerda? Maybe we should go down and talk to the psychic or something. Because we just found all those play pieces. Hey, AJ. Oh, there you go, AJ. Hope you're having fun with that one. <laughs> I just added that one. Oh, we can't talk to her. Whoa. Sit down, Grace. All right. Let's tell her about Von Glower's letter. There's something I think you should see. Oh, she's gonna love this. <laughs> oh my. Oh, there it is. Has Gabriel seen this? No. Nope. Well, my dear, I understand your reluctance, but it's his karma, you know? It's his choice. He's the son, you know, Von Glauer. He's the son of Von Rolick. 
Yes, I think you're right. And he wants Gabriel. So it seems. But that doesn't mean Gabriel wants that life. He didn't ask to be bitten. <sighs> you don't know him like I do. Running on all fours wouldn't be a big stretch. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Grace. I won't tell you the choice will be an easy one. But it's a battle he must fight. All you can do is believe in him. That's all you can do. Man, Grace is so salty all the time. Now you be careful. Maybe she's still mad about the book. Everyone needs that haircut. Which haircut? Like the haircut of the psychic lady? I guess I wouldn't be surprised if... Well, does everyone really need the beehive haircut? I don't think everyone needs a beehive. God, beehives. Does anyone still wear a beehive haircut? Or, or was it just Amy Winehouse? Well, I guess Amy Winehouse was a while ago, but has anyone worn a beehive since Amy, Ware or Amy Winehouse? Did I call her Warehouse? No, Amy Winehouse. <laughs> God, it's been a while. <laughs> oh, jeez. Yeah, it's late. I, you can tell it's late. <laughs> Let's show him this letter and see what he says. I, uh, I hope that it goes well. Oh, you know what I might do? Um, I might make a pit stop by the chapel. Beehive with your marabou? What, you want to add some honey onto that now? I'll tell him about the letter, eventually, when I have everything else under control. Oh, she's going to maintain maximum control on this. You know what? I respect her this for that. This is the only copy of Wagner's Lost Opera. All right. Pretty big deal, to be honest. Oh, are we going to learn anything else, or is he just going to be salty still? for hell. Oh. You're going to be fine. Um, oh. I don't know about that. Not the hair, Grace. <laughs> <laughs> He's got his priorities, yeah. Got a smile. He'll be all right. He'll be, he'll be okay. That's her Gabriel. <laughs> oh, jeez. Stop messing up my hair, Gracie. What good is being a werewolf if you can't have nice hair doing it? Like, the entire allure of becoming a werewolf is that you get more hair. Oh, this place is empty, son. Alright. Those look better. Yeah, gonna... That silver heart reminds me of the silver penitent gifts at Altotting. I wonder if... No, that wouldn't be right. Maybe I should just ask her. Oh, well, it's easier to beg forgiveness and uh, ask permission. I wonder if... All right, all right, let's talk to Gerda. We're finally going to talk to Gerda. Well, well, well. What do you know, Grace? I guess we'll just ask her and then we'll come back and grab that thing. I was right, we would need it. All right, Gerda, I've got a million dollar question for you, my lady. Gerda, I have something to ask you. It's really awful. What is it? You know the silver heart you got for Wolfgang's casket? Yes. If I paid you to have another one made, do you think I could take the one at St. George's? 
It's for Gabriel, isn't it? Yes. Take it. Wolfgang will understand. Thank you so much, Gerda. Don't worry. Dreamboat Wolfgang will get it. Hey, look at her. She's okay with it. I mean, if you ask Gerda anything about helping the shot and Jaegers, she will not hesitate. She will say yes like that. Ah. God bless her. Mm -mm -mm. Well, now that we've got access to his heart, I think we've got ourselves a gift for the church. So let's mosey on back over there and get Ludwig's heart. Finally, finally, we're going to have a, a human heart in our inventory. God, that's going to be wild. <laughs> oh, jeez. To be fair, we are playing a horror game right now. A quote-unquote horror game. Well, I don't know how scary it really is. It's got more supernatural and mystery in it than horror, to be honest, but, you know... Alright, uh, service should be done over here, I think. Sounds pretty quiet in here. Yeah, okay, I think we're good to go. There it is. Hello. Hello there, Friar. Believe your service is done. I now have an offer for you. Yeah, let's give him this. I have a gift for the Madonna, Father. God, that's gotta be expensive. How much do you think that thing costs? Cost a small fortune to have that kind of thing made, bro. Ah, oh, looky looky. Well, here we are. I hope it was worth it, Gracie. Okay. Yeah, go ahead and have a nice look around. Case the place. Yeah. It's the Lady of Altading. Oh, of course it is. The heart earns. Wait, wait. I think I know which one is Ludwig's, but how am I going to get it down? Which one is Ludwig's? Is that one? I think... I think... I can't tell which one is his. I think it's the one on, like, the left or something. Oh, wait, she can walk around. Oh, check that out. Yeah, look at that if walk. If I could get away with moving that chair, I could reach the urns. Okay. He's praying for me. Good. I need all the help I can get. Hmm. I think the box is for penitent offerings. Oh, hey, we're supposed to put that in there? Oh, hey, there it goes. I guess we're supposed to kneel and pray with him, aren't we? I'm trying to figure out how this goes. Because I've never seen anything like this. Oh, okay. Well, there's lots of people in there. Take this gift. I think you know why I'm here. I apologize for even thinking of violating your shrine. But you know I need to get what's inside Ludwig's urn. I think you want me to help him and Gabriel. Gabriel may be egotistical and selfish, but he's got a good heart, I think. Anyway, he doesn't deserve this curse. Help me help both of them. Please. Ooh. That sounded like an answered prayer to me. 
Oh, I think I'm picking up what's being put down here. Gotta blow out those candles, bro. Oh, wait. Oh, it's really glowing. Bit drafty in here, isn't it? We should push that door open a little more, Grace. We'll just say that God helps those who help themselves. Ahem, and give this a good shove. Ahem. This works. And here it comes. Shoom. Let that air come on. Hmm, fresh air. I only have a few seconds. I know you do. So don't dilly dally. Get that heart. Get that heart. Oh, you maniac. How can you see in the dark? Come on. He's just feeling around for stuff. Here, grab that. Grab it. I think that's the right heart. Hope it's the right heart. Is that Ludwig's? Yeah, it's our urn now. Dude, how, how, how are you gonna take that? Oh god, you. Oh, oh. Wait. What? Where's the heart? I thought we were gonna have a heart in our pocket. It's not a heart. That's. That's just a certificate of authenticity. This is fake news. I, I was promised a heart. <laughs> oh, boy. Eh. All right, they're working on getting the candles back. Well, how do you feel, Gracie? You feel good about yourself? Eh. I mean, it was just a certificate. They won't miss it too much. God, this guy can pray, huh? Well, that was nice, I guess. He is so confused, this man. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Hey. Oh, look at this guy. He's so happy right now. Wait for it to set in. Oh, he, he's looking at it. Yeah. Wait till he realizes what it is. Could it be? It is. There you go. It's all settling in. Look at what we have done. Two months later. Oh my god. Two months. Two months. Oh. She's really playing the long con, isn't she? Well, that was a hell of a way to trap a werewolf staging a whole opera. <laughs> God. Well, this is how we're going to do it, I guess. Der Fluch des Engelhart by Richard Wagner, conducted by Herr Klaus Immerding and Herr Georg Immerding. I can't believe we've pulled it off. Neither can I, to be honest, in two months, no less. Usually arranging this type of thing takes a really long time. God, look at this. It's all so classy and so professional. We're going to the opera, guys. I don't know how many of you expected to hear an opera tonight, but... um. 
sorry to break it to you. We are uh, probably, yeah, we're going to be here in one. <laughs> uh. We have one hour, people. Hey, Emmerding. Hey, Emmerding. Yes, Mr. Costello. Hey, Emmerding, I must again protest about my lack of vocalization in Act Three. I have not a single note until the transformation hour. Now, how many times do we have to go over this? You are disguised as a silent minstrel. I know that. But an aria, sung to the audience, off to one side, would be very effective. Hildegard has one. Yes, but the audience is not supposed to know it's you until the transformation into a wolf. It's a surprise. You know, surprise. I realize that's the way it's written. I simply disagree with its effectiveness. Your opinion is noted. Actors. It's time to get the bloody Georg. You go. I, uh, I want to go over this one more time. Everybody's got to be a prima donna. Might as well look at this whole place, I'm huh? Nervous enough. Thank God it's not me on that stage tonight. Yeah. Put it mildly. Is there anything else in here we can look at, or can we just? I'm nervous. I guess we're just going to talk to this guy. Wait, wait, wait. Ooh, hello. What's going on over here? How's the installation going? All right. Will the last one be up soon? Yeah, soon. Okay. Thanks, bud. Glad we can count on you. Thanks for being here. Thanks for doing what you do. I'm not sure what else to say at the moment. <laughs> He's trying to take charge, but this is like all this guy's show, I think. Got it. How are you holding up, Georg? Oh, man. I'm going crazy. I wish I had never blacked my blouse into letting me conduct. Don't be ridiculous. The opera was your discovery, Georg, remember? You'll be famous after tonight. Assuming I don't make a complete ass of myself. <laughs> be fair, I think the actor has already done that. Grace, you think you're nervous? Imagine how this guy feels. God, the pressure he must be feeling. Brrr. Can't imagine. I can't imagine being in an opera. That's gotta be hard. Uh, oh god, this place is creepy. Lots of drains around here. At least they don't have to worry about flooding. Like, everything sounds so cheerful, sort of upstairs, but down here, bleh, this is a lot. Lots? Cool air's coming in through that vent. It must lead outside. Cool. That's curious. We try that door. That it wants to explore the basement. Oh, it is open. Well, well, well. Color me shocked. I didn't think I, I was gonna get Gabriel back to Riddersburg before tonight. This room might do the trick. But I need to be able to lock it. Jeez. Some of the volume spikes on that audio was a bit much. <laughs> a lot of theater junk. Looks like an old set piece. Hmm. Looks... 
What about over this way? Is there anything here? Looks like an old set piece. A lot of theater junk. Right. Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, okay. Oh, that might actually be useful. Yeah. Yeah, I just did. Wait, are you just stuffing that in your pants? <laughs> In her pants. A lot of, a lot of, <laughs> a lot of, a lot. Of, oh my god, I love this stuff. <laughs> oh god, why did they direct her to do that? <laughs> oh, that's too much. It's too much. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna cry. So good. <laughs> Oh man. Alright, is there anything else in this? Uh, oh, 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 there's more. Okay. There's depths to this basement. Oh, that's curious. What are we gonna mess with there, Grace? Oh, that looks. Uh, what is that? Those look like they go to something or another. Not much in here. Oh, I guess we just needed keys. Well, in that case, I guess, can we just, I don't know, lock the door that we came from? Here, let's try locking it. Oh, hey, yep. Yeah. Sure enough. Well, at least the puzzles are kind of logical. I gotta say, like, trying to get the levels just right on Gabriel Knight 2 while you're streaming it is is tough because the levels in the game itself are just kind of all over the place. Some clips are, are spiking, some are really quiet. Uh, sometimes it feels like Sierra just wasn't really sure what they were doing when they were making, like, the full motion video stuff. Oh, wait, what we got here? Oh, some of this stuff looks like it might be useful. Come on, you never know when you might need a bucket. Or some boxes. Oh, hey. I'm not sure why I'd want to do that. I'm not sure why I'd want to... I don't know. I mean, it's a furnace. I just, I'm just looking around right now. The furnace doesn't appear to be running at the moment. I'm not sure why... Well, we could turn it I... on. You never know. You might want to turn it on. Perhaps it's getting cold. I don't know. I don't have a good answer for you. I just want to turn things on. It is my wand. Alright. Uh, yeah. I don't think it's go... I don't think anything is going on over this way. I think we've found everything of interest in here. Alright, alright, alright. Um, I think we came from this way. Yeah. Well, if we came from this way, let's go to the stairs off to the left and see what happened. Where will this take us, I wonder? Oh, oh yeah, that's... Okay. Is there anything here we can, I don't know, mess with? That rope might come in handy. Oh, sure, just... Yeah, just take the rope, you maniac. Oh god, she's gonna take... She's just gonna take the rope, isn't she? Brilliant. Brilliant, Grace. Oh my gosh, she just took a random rope. She's lucky that something didn't come careening down on top of her. 
God, you just can't mess around with stuff. Look at these guys. They didn't even care. They didn't care. It's amazing. Anything else you want to steal while you're here, Grace? They'll find something else to use with the pulley. Ah, yeah. yeah screw these guys, right? They'll find some. <laughs> it's their job. I, I like how they didn't even try to stop her. They just couldn't be arsed to do it. The ah, dressing that's... rooms are back there. They're ah. probably a madhouse right now. You tell me we don't want to go back there? I I absolutely want to go back there, to be honest. Over this way. Oh, 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 oh. There's no... Where are we right now? Oh, there we are. God, I can barely see myself. Or... I'm nervous. There's no... There's no easy way to get there from inside the auditorium. I guess let's just explore each of these rooms until we find the right thing. Gracie, what do you see? There's no easy way. Yeah. There's like nothing in any of these rooms, I don't think. Is there? I don't know. Just taking a look at every one of them, just in case we run into something, because that's like the law of adventure games. And these mid-90s ones are very particular about going through every little thing. Yeah, they're all kind of just here. They're all kind of just here to mess with us a little bit. What if I go up and like... Yeah, let's go in this room. And... What do we find? Why we find a whole lot of I'm the same old stuff. Grace oh, Nakamura. Oh. Yes, thank you, Grace. I'm glad you identified yourself. Oh, hey, here's her dressing room. Hey, or yes, her dressing room. What do we got here? That's a mighty fine dress you got. He's going to be getting all dolled up tonight for sure. Here's that list I made. Oh wait, can you can you let me read that, please? <laughs> that might be useful, Gracie. <laughs> Might as well take this too. I mean, you never know when opera glasses might come in use any time, but during an actual opera. Are uh, you done, Grace? All right. Oh, Old playbills and schedules. Oh, wait. Oh, we can take that. I believe that's a blueprint of the Opera House. A seating chart. Oh. This might be useful. You gonna stuff that in your pants, too? No, she's gonna put it in her pocket. How how is she like fitting the sign in there? Is that just up against her thigh? Is it like I don't know, kind of nestled in her shoe or something? Uh, how how is she making that work? Old play. Just, old. I just. Old. I feel like I need to know. Old. Yeah, there's nothing else there. That's that's done. I'm not ready to get dressed yet. All right. Yeah, we have to change. Eventually, not quite. Yet. The middle loge. That looks like the best box in the house. It certainly is. It's a seating chart for the theater. It's a seating chart for the theater. Alright. We're not going to get anything else from that. How you doing, Gabe? It's been two months. Are you feeling any better yet? Are you feeling a little peckish? You uh, wolfing down any food recently? How do you feel? Those are your high? Put broken glass in my brain. Jesus Christ. Holy God. I thought Good we God. be back in Riddersburg by now. The Smiths are waiting for you there. It's okay. Just stick me in a room somewhere. Are we ready for the test? I'll check. 
Could you see about some heat, Gracie? Oh, yeah, he's freezing in here. Oh. He is not doing going? great. Sure. It's cold. I'll see what I can do. It's not cold at all, is it? It's yeah. not. You do that. Gabe! Jozo, you're high. AJ's high. Is anyone else in chat high? Poor Gabriel. I should let him rest. He's been resting well, he for. Still can. Yeah, mm, mm, there it is. He's been resting for two months. I think he's gotten about as much rest as he's gonna get. Soon enough, he's just gonna be a werewolf, dude. Uh, uh Gabe to be safe in Rittersburg, Night of Opera, Warn, H I. About possible distraction. Wait until the last minute. Figure out where to seat Von Glauer and Lieber and form Usher of seating plans. Set up secondary spotlight on BG. I don't know what that means. But, oh, Von Glauer. Find a way to trap Von Glauer and seat. Set up uh, MTG with Lieber at theater. Make sure he's armed. Oh, we're gonna make sure Lieber's got a gun. Cool. Uh, thanks for that plunger, AJ. I appreciate that. I don't have a plunger in chat. I mean, I am highly distraught at all times. You know where we're gonna go? We're gonna go upstairs. Yeah, let's go upstairs. Got lots of stuff to look at, lots of things to do. I'll be honest, guys, I kind of just assume that everyone's high while I'm playing these things. <laughs> I guess the real question is, who among us is sober in here? <laughs> this box is called the Mythologe. Oh, you just figured that out, Grace? Yeah, that's that's the middle one. It's a good box. It's a nice box. These seats look comfortable. I bet they do. These seats. Anything you want to do? In it's there? a long way down. Oh, you don't say. It's a long way down. Everyone is. <laughs> Everyone's high. All right. Cool. Well, in that case, I guess that makes your enjoyment of Gabriel Knight 2, The Beast Within, all the more, uh, enjoyable, I guess. Hard to say. Looks like I found a spotlight, and one that's not often used by the look of it. I should try to aim the spotlight, but I haven't decided where to see Von Glauer yet. Oh, Monkey On's a hit because everyone's just high. <laughs> Everyone watching adventure games out there is just high. I could shine the spotlight just about anywhere if I wanted to. I believe that's the middle loge box over there. Yeah, that's the box we want to shine this at, bro. Now I'm worried I'm just boring everyone and that's why they're getting high. <laughs> no, I, this doesn't, it's not that important to me <laughs> if people are getting high. <laughs> I'm nervous. And Keep living your best life, friendos. Grace Nakamura. Is there anything in these boxes or are we just kind of messing around here? There's no, e There's no easy way to get there from inside the auditorium. Hmm.
Yeah, these these rooms are just nothing. The restrooms are back there. I don't oh. need to go that way at the moment. Oh, that's where the restrooms are? For real? Oh, okay. That's cool, I guess. I just want to see if there's, like, anything in these rooms that I should be aware of. I don't think that there is. I think they're just showing us lots of pretty opera boxes. <laughs> there's no easy way to get there from inside. Scary ass place, God. I mean, this is it's a it's a little spooky. I well, the basement was pretty pretty uh, weird. I won't lie about that. The basement kind of creeped me out a bit. Here, let me try talking to George again. I'm nervous and Oh hey, we can't talk to him again. Yeah. Georg, I need you to promise me something. What? There may be some distractions tonight in the audience in Act Three. I need you to keep playing no matter what. What distractions? What are you saying? Don't get upset. It's just well. It is opening night. The audience might be a bit rowdy, you know? Are you serious? But we have extra security <laughs> lined up, so if anything were to happen, it would be taken care of. So just, you know, keep playing. Grace, I, I do not even want to know what you are talking about. This is a brand new Wagner opera. I am not going to stop the performance, even if, if Wagner himself comes floating out on stage. Great. That's exactly what I wanted to hear. Oh my god. <laughs> Luigi's mansion with the lights on. That's what you think of this place. <laughs> oh hey, the chandelier diagram. Here, let's take a look at this. Chandelier diagram. Wagner's layout of the theater. Wagner's layout of the theater. Oh, we got words with them. Herr Silbermeier, I know you're working as fast as you can, but we're opening in less than an hour. I really need to run through some music for <laughs> them. Hi, music. They will not fall down. I'm sure they won't, but uh, look, you told me they'd be done by noon. Well, you are lucky that we could even make them in so little time. And then we drive them here special this morning. I know that. I know. You've been great. It's just... Is everything at least going according to the diagram? Yeah, we make it work. What do you mean, we make it work? <laughs> this diagram is not so good. Uh, we make changes, yeah? Oh, my God. Uh-oh. Look, there weren't supposed to be changes. I told you to follow the diagram exactly. Uh-oh. <laughs> Maybe in 1945, we follow diagram exactly. But today, we make changes. <laughs> oh. What are you saying? These measurements are not the same as today. Now, if we make the chandeliers the same distance from each other, just as marked, but the distance from chandeliers to the walls, no, not the same. Why aren't the measurements the same? This is the Wittelbacher Theater, isn't it? Yeah, but not the same Wittelsbacher Theater. The bombs hit the first one. This one is very close, but smaller. But everything looks so old. Oh, they take the art and the wood and save it. Remake theater later, after the war. Of course. Of course. How could I be so stupid? I'm a history major. Oh, it's okay. The chandeliers work good. Same distance from each other, but just not to walls. Yes. Oh, that's a raw deal, Gracie. I'm sure you've done your best. Thank you. Oh, boy. That's bad. Well, 
And we make lemons, or lemonade out of lemons there, Gracie. Oof. Thanks for the screaming flatulence earlier, guys. I really appreciate that. By the way, how'd the level sound on your guys' end? Was that good? Was the farting loud enough? Did it get the point across, AJ Zombies? <laughs> I do enjoy a good fart sound effect. Mm. Do I ever. Good. God, I hope the levels weren't... I hope the levels were good. I've, I've been adjusting them recently. Oh, I think they're okay. I think they're okay. I've given... There's... Um... God, I think that's all we have to do there. Um, let's go upstairs. Here, let me check something real quick. I want to take a look at this diagram again. I suppose that large X had something to do with the seating arrangements. It's in a nice line from the chandeliers. I should have added an Ikea emote. I don't know if I want to add an Ikea emote. You guys really want an Ikea emote? I want... Fine. Let's check something. Oh, God. There is an Ikea emote. All right. I added an Ikea emote to Better Twitch TV. You're welcome. <laughs> God. <laughs> I, I added it. I hope you enjoy it. It's it's there. God. Yeah, there it is. All right. Uh, let's go into the map. Oh, no, we're, we're going to go into the map. My bad. I need to see this. Yeah, there it is. Okay. The large X on Wagner's diagram is in an area called the Mittel Loge on the seating chart. I'd better check it out. Oh, we're going to do that again, huh? Is, is this what we're looking for? Okay, check it out, Gracie. Oh, she's pulling out her papers. She she's taking it. This is definitely the Mitologia. According to Wagner, von Glauer gets seated here. Libra two. Now I just need to find a way to block the doors. God. You know. For all that detective work, we could have just asked the people who work here if this was the Mitteloge. Why doesn't she just ask anyone who speaks German if it is so? Such a roundabout way of doing things. Oh, you're welcome, AJ. I'm glad you enjoy it. You love how there's a preset IKEA mode? Yeah, I know. I, it was really, really easy. All I had to do was search IKEA and bam, there it was. I can't believe it was there. That's amazing. There's the hot seat. Okay, we... I could shine the spot. There's the hot seat. That's that's where I want to shine the light. So let's do it. Go. Let's, let's do it. Flick that thing on, Gracie. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's gonna be good. All right. Uh. Should we like? Oh, that's how we aim it. We gotta take the handle. Well, that makes sense. Right there. Uh, oh, oh, there it goes. It was letting me control the light with my mouse there for a second. That really felt weird. That was kind of cool. Yeah, that was nice. I like that. Uh, are we ready to get things started yet? Is the opera about to begin? Ooh. 
Wait, is that just... Oh, that's just... Oh, oh, this guy's out He's here. He's Paul, the head usher. Der Fluch des Engels. I can't believe we've pulled it off. Here, let me see if I can, like... I don't know, can we... Do we talk to this guy? Do we... I don't think he'd... He's... And I... Hmm. Oh, what if I just show him the seating chart? Oh, there it goes. Yeah. You're going to see two special invitations tonight. One is addressed to a man named Baron von Glauer. The other is Commissar Lieber. Both will be seated in the middle loge. I have it marked here. No problem. Oh, and when Commissar Lieber arrives, please find me. I need to speak with him before he's seated. Yes, von Akimura. We've almost got it all set up. I think it's time to go change into our fine clothes. I'm not ready to get dressed yet. Really? Oh, I guess we'll talk to Gabriel, though. All right, Gabe. Let's give him an update. I think he'll appreciate it. Aw, well, that sounds so romantic. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, he's he's looking terrible. Is it time for the test yet? <laughs> no. Don't you worry about that. Everything will be fine. You'll see. Everything's going to be okay, Gabe. Ah, oh, that false reassurance. Well, he's trying. God, he is in bad shape. I'm not ready to get... Oh, he's not ready yet? For real? What the hell are we looking at, then? Where am I... Where am I... Where, what, what now? What more could there possibly be? Do we have to go talk to this guy I've again? given Georg enough to worry about. Yeah, I'd say. You're really giving him a hassle. He's Paul. I could use some fresh air, but I don't have time to go outside. Wait, wait, wait. Is there anything over there? I don't think there is. No. No, there's nothing over there. Oh, wait. Do we have to hang the private sign up there? Oh. Maybe that's what we gotta do. We gotta hang the private side on the Mitchell Loge. Well, she's been carrying that around in her pants long enough that I guess we can do that. Oh, we don't do it yet? Ah, oh, this game is very particular. <laughs> what more can we possibly do, bro? What more is there? Do I have anything else in my inventory? Theater rope... Like, am I supposed to tie this down or something? Oh, wait, what if I... Oh, wait, no, I think I'm supposed to use that for, like, mm, something else. I don't remember what it was. Oh, wait, maybe I'm supposed to give Gabriel the... the Schottenjäger amulet. Yeah, let's go ahead and try giving him that. Oh, she's not going to give it to him yet. Kill me here, Gracie. Only a matter of time before this opera starts, dude. There can't be that much more to do. We're almost there. We're in like the home stretch. I'm gonna go like backstage, I think. Yeah, let's go over that way. There we go. The dressing rooms are back there. They're probably a madhouse right now. That's a fair point. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Gabriel said that he was cold. Uh, 
that's right, there's a furnace down in the basement. Oh my god, I forgot about that. Yeah, he's he's cold, so we gotta go warm him up a little bit. Oh, Grace. That's not too hard. I mean, you just it's just a little coal. Clean, beautiful coal, right? Yeah, open that up. Yeah, there it is. Alright. Oh wow, that thing looks dead. Time of the year is it anyway? I don't know, Grace, but grab a handful of that stuff and toss it in. Or she's just gonna shovel it. Wow, that really is just a whole dumpster full of coal, isn't it? Sure is. Oh, she's so proud of herself. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, wait, that's all the coal you're going to put in there? Okay. I don't know anything about furnaces like this, so I, I don't know if that's a good amount of coal or not that much. If anyone wants to educate me, feel free. All right, let's turn around. Uh, we're gonna turn it to Mitchell. I don't think this is working for some reason. The pilot is already lit. Oh. There we go. Oh, that should do it. Ah, oh, there it goes. Yeah, look at that fire. Oh, that's classy looking fire right there. That's a good fire effect for 1994. That totally looks like fire and not, I don't know, fake. <laughs> Hey, Mr. Boomstick, how you doing tonight, dude? Good to see you. Hope life's been treating you good since I saw you last. Oh, yeah, that's fire. It might not be, like, the nicest fire I've ever seen, but that's fire. That'll burn you. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Toasty. Maybe Gabriel will feel warm now. Nakimura. Yes. It's time to open the doors. So soon? We're not ready. The performance starts in 15 minutes. The people have been waiting outside for over an hour. All right, just give me five minutes, okay? <sighs> okay. The doors will open in five minutes. No pressure. Five minutes. Five minutes. Oh, we are in so much trouble. Uh, we should go this way. Hmm. I'm not ready to get dressed. Oh, is he is he warm yet? Is he comfy? Are you good, Gabriel? Uh oh. Is he is he is he okay? Gabriel. We have to move you now. <laughs> <sighs> I was not settling. Is it time for the test? No, we don't have time. I found a safe place for you downstairs. You'll be all right there. But the test? It's too late to change anything now, even if we could test it. Come on. Ugh. <laughs> <sighs> <sighs> uh. Cross your fingers and hope that this works, right guys? I don't know, they might be in trouble. Oh, he can walk. Okay, that's promising. Maybe he's not as bad off as I thought he was. Oof, ouch. Does it lock? Oh, he wants to be locked in? Plug your ears and you probably won't feel a thing. Oh, yeah, I still wish we tested it. We're not going to get another shot, Gracie. Just rest. I'll see you later. Really serious about this. Okay. He ain't cracking jokes anymore. <laughs> I guess after a couple of months it settles in, doesn't it? Got anything to say Gabriel? before? What? I have to tell you something. I screwed up. Uh oh. Oh. What are you talking about, Gracie? The chandelier foreman had to change the measurements. It's the theater. 
It's not the same Wittelbacher Theater. It's been rebuilt, and this one is smaller. Oh, boy. I'm not sure. I'm not sure the crystals will work. I can't believe you did this. God damn you, Gracie! You did it on purpose, didn't you? Gabriel! Open the door! Open the goddamn door! No. You open the door this minute. If you can't manage a simple goddamn fucking diagram, I'll take care of things myself! Myself, do you hear me? Open it! I'm sorry. Jesus I'll do the Christ. best I can. Gracie! Jesus. Gracie! Christ. Yeah, don't open that door, Gracie. Open that door, he might eat you. <laughs> oh my goodness. The theater is ready to open. Oh, Grace. Guess now's as good a time as ever to put on your dress. Hmm. Oh, we're still we're still doing this, huh? Oh, maybe it's even some IKEA animated commands. I don't know that we have like a. I don't know if there is one. Um, it doesn't really look like there is. Unfortunately. All right, what what are we gonna do here? Um, I think we're gonna go upstairs. Actually, let me go put my dress on. It might be a good time to do that. Yeah, all right, it is time to do it. Yeah, all right, she's gonna get in the fancy clothes, baby. Yeah. He's ready for the opera. Mm, 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 mm. Come in. Wait. Oh. Commissar Lieber at your service. I'm one of the show's producers, Herr Lieber. Thank you so much for helping us out this evening. You came with another officer and you came armed, is that correct? Just as the invitation specified. But why did you ask me? The Ordnungspolizei usually supply extra security. One of our producers is a fan of yours. We needed the extra security, and he wanted to make sure you got good seats for tonight's performance. Oh, they are very good seats, very generous. But is there some specific trouble you're expecting this evening? Believe me when I say that nothing at all will probably happen. I hope you are right. I would like to meet this man after the performance. I hope that will be possible, Commissar. Thank you again. My pleasure. Oh, the man who enjoys culture. I imagine he would be very happy to get these seats. I think I know what we need to do. We need to go upstairs and make sure that Von Glauer has entered the theater. Von Glauer, take your seats. The overture is starting. We're ready to begin. This is going to be one hell of an opera. Howlingly good, you might say. <laughs> ah, yes. Ah, yes. Um, should we use these? Oh, there we go. Yeah, there it is. Take a good look, Gracie. There he is. Oh, he's got a date tonight. So yeah. that's Von Glauer. It looks like he's clueless about the truth. Now we just need to make sure he doesn't get out. Need to make sure he just doesn't get out. Hmm. 
Well, we can do that, can't we? Uh-oh. Act 1 is starting. Oh, we might... oh, that sounds... Oh, that music sounds very ominous, doesn't it? <laughs> the opera is starting, friends. Grace, let's make sure he doesn't get out. I know exactly what we need. Uh, actually, let's tie this first. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Let's let's see how her knot tying skills go. Oh, that's. Hey, Network Brian, how you doing, dude? Good to see you. Oh, is that is that the knot she's gonna tie? Totally subtle. Yeah, I'll say that's not. Yeah, that's not a clean knot. I'm pretty sure that if someone pulls at that long enough, it's gonna come undone. There are better knots to tie, Gracie. <laughs> Here, let me see if I can find something real quick. Ah. Perfect. <laughs> Sorry, I just had to add a couple of emotes just now. Uh, for anyone using better Twitch TV, I added Nicolas Cage emotes. <laughs> I can't help it, it's unhinged. It was too good not to. Alright, let's go ahead and make this knot here a little bit more subtle. Oh, she's gonna clean that up a little bit? Okay. Oh yeah, that'll do it. And how is that gonna hang? Um Wait, she did she just yeah, tape that? To Wagner. God, where did she get the tape? I didn't have any tape in my inventory. Uh oh. Alright, act two. Okay, this is gonna get hairy real fast, I think. Oh, he looks anxious. Gotta get out of there, don't you there, Gabriel? How am I gonna get out of this room? Oh, I guess we're taking control of Gabriel now. Cool. No, oh, can I network Brian? I guess I appreciate that. Um Hey. Thanks for the flatulence, AJ. We really needed that, man. Uh God, I love that people play that fart all the time. <laughs> All the time, you guys just keep playing them farts. Why do you guys love those farts so much, you maniacs? What do we got here? Oh, that looks like a vent to me. Use those big werewolf muscles, Gabe. Yeah. Oh, look at all this. Good God, they... Grace left him a dagger? Look at this. This guy's turning into a werewolf. She left a dagger in his inventory. Oh my God. So all we got in our inventory is a barely started manuscript, a business card, Mun Mun, and a knife. Of course we got a knife. Is there anything like in here we can grab? There's nothing but a lot you of You have made me here. very angry. Very this music indeed. down slightly. <laughs> 
<laughs> There's nothing but a lot of useless junk in here. <laughs> Alright, the levels on that seem a little bit better. God, Sierra always like pumps up the levels too hard on their uh, audio versus their voices. Thanks, Network Brian, for the very angry. I appreciate that. There's nothing but a lot of useless junk in here. There's nothing. All right. Well, you heard Gabriel. It's nothing but junk. Let's get out this knife and see what happens. Ah, cool. Look at this. What's he gonna do? You gonna cut through that or? Oh, he's gonna. Oh, he's just gonna use it. To pry stuff. Cool. Yeah, that's definitely a good use for your dagger. That's what the dagger gets used for in this one, huh? God, that's how you stuff it in your pants, dude? That's so unsafe. God, get a get a sheath for it. Get a scabbard, man. <laughs> we'll just we'll just stuff it in there, you maniac. <laughs> What happens when this guy sits down? <laughs> that knife is so big. Ah, oh, jeez. Gracie really should have considered that Gabriel was going to be able to move that case. Wait, Damn we're outside. Yeah, there's a hell of a lot of nothing out there. Oh, he found the hallway. And he's out. God help us all. Werewolf Gabriel is on the loose. Oh, wait. Uh, are you... Wait, are you gonna replace what you did there? It'd be kind of nice if you did. Oh, hey, look, he's cleaning up after himself. How do you like that? Hey! I'm a werewolf, not a monster. Never mind. You know, it would have been nice if you had at least tried there. <laughs> uh, God, some of those emotes that we're seeing in chat. <laughs> it's no use. I broke the damn thing. Oh, nice work, Gabe. All right, well, that's great for us. Um... Is there anything around here that we can use? Oh, anything good on them shelves? If I open that door, the fire might go out, and I'm freezing. The fire doesn't need any more coal. You sound so mad. What it you seems so mad to be running for? okay. I don't want to mess with the controls. What are you so mad for, Gabe? Nothing to be mad about right now. Well, other than the fact that you're turning into a werewolf, so... Eh, you know, I'll just keep my mouth shut. You got plenty to be upset about right now, Gabe. I don't need anything from the prop room. I don't need anything from the prop room. Besides, Gracie locked the door. That's a fair point. How about we go this way? Let's check these halls. See if there's anything good. Oh, hey, we can mess around with this. We're gonna flip a switch. Yeah, this is gonna be... We do, Gabe. It's empty. It's empty. Wait, that's it? We just... It's empty. We just no. took a look at that for nothing? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, AJ. <laughs> Is there anything in here we can use? I don't think there is. I think there's a whole lot of nothing over here, guys. All right, let's get on out of here, I think. Yeah, let's go this way. 
I gotta. Yeah. It's over this way. Is this? Hey, this is. This goes backstage, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, yes, it do. Oh. I wonder if this pulley is being used for anything. Now, oh, hell. Who cares? Wonder if. Now, oh, hell. Who cares? Well, it's apathy is noted. That roll of tape might be useful. <laughs> Did I just get pranked? I didn't just get pranked. You know what's funny, guys, is that all the overlays that we have on this channel, someone on one of my YouTube videos got all mad about the May Mays. And... To be fair, they were a little loud, but they also said they don't need to be there, like... Or they don't add anything to what you're doing and stuff like that. I don't know why you added them, and it's like... I was I told the person, dude, this is from a stream. I didn't add these in post. People are just playing them. <laughs> like they they paid for the privilege. <laughs> Wonder if this pull is being used for anything. Oh hell. Alright, I guess we're not doing anything with this. That's it's whatever. Uh, is there anything over here we can use? No, there's nothing over here, bro. All right, we'll just go in here. Yeah. Oh, we're in it. This is the dressing room, isn't it? Oh, that's cool. Oh, hey, what if we like? What are you gonna do? Are you gonna powder yourself, you Not maniac? Putting on makeup with these jeans. Uh, how about we... Oh. Oh, wait, what's he gonna do? Oh. This fool's gonna put on a costume, isn't he? Englehart's minstrel costume. Can I take any of this stuff? Or do I have to get dressed first? No point in putting on makeup with these jeans. Alright, alright. I guess I have to get I guess I have to get dressed first. Let me turn that let me turn down this music even more. I'll turn it down to like right there. Just because the music seems like it's overpowering the voices. Alright, gay, put on your costume. Yeah, there he goes. Let's see what you look like there, bud. Yeah! Oh, he looks so good! He looks glorious! Oh! Yes! Oh my god, you're perfect, Gabriel. You couldn't look any better. Alright, doll yourself up. We're going on stage, bro. Um, here, what if we, like, powder the window? Yeah, let's powder the window. Come on, powder the window! Let's go! It's the end of the second act, Gabe. You gotta move! Oh my god, look at this. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, that actually doesn't look that bad. That looks like a smoother job than I, I would have thought. Alright, alright. Maybe it's gonna work. They really covered that, uh... They really covered that mirror in between takes, didn't they? Alright, here we go, Gabe. See if this works, huh? Ah, oh, there's the actor. Curious and curiouser, isn't it? Ah, uh, yes, he'll never see this coming. Oh, you're just, you're just, you're not cleaning anything up, man. You're just kind of moving dirt around at this point. Uh, Gabe? 
Are you just going to hide behind there? Okay, let's see if we can... I don't know, let's just go out here and do something. Uh, what are we going to do to him? Yeah, is he going to... What, what are you going to do, Gabe? Okay. Okay, he doesn't see me coming. Oh! Oh, yeah, that, that worked famously. No, local novelist disappears. Strange circumstances leave authorities baffled. In events that could have come straight from one of his own books, mystery novelist sensation Gabriel Knight has become an enigma himself. Spokespersons in Germany reported his disappearance two months after his co-production of the now famous Lost Opera. Oh, I didn't get to read all that. Oh, I died. Man. Oh. That was pretty good. Yeah, we got to hear the howl one time before the stream, or before the this game ended. It's good stuff. All right, all right, all right. Um, maybe we need to grab something from. Oh. Hey, what's this? What do we got here, man? Doing okay there, Gabe? What are you doing? Oh, you see the evidence of werewolfism? Lycanism, rather? Uh... Gabe might as well be. I wonder if that's what, just what lycanism... like costumes for the male lead in the opera. So what do I grab here, man? Uh, God, I, I don't know. I guess we just, is there, is there like something I didn't grab that I was supposed to? Maybe I don't have what I need here. we leave? Oh, hey, we can leave. Actually, we don't need to go down here, do we? We can just, like, go through the halls, can't we? Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, let's take a good look around before we put on a fancy costume and decide to mug someone in the dressing room. I can't go out into the main hall. Oh. Well, that does cause a problem, doesn't it? In that case, what if we just go this way? I can't go up there. If the ushers see me, they'll call security. Oh. Wow, we are in a tough spot, aren't we? Okay. God. All right, Gabe, I guess we gotta get creative, huh? second. Oh, you're new here, AJ? Oh, I didn't know. Well, hot diggity. Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, it's tape. It's tape. Oh, okay. I guess I was missing something. Yeah, seems important. God, it was, was it that hard to just grab tape, bro? Did you have to make a whole scene? <laughs> it was just tape, Gabriel. God. Alright, put on your fanciful costume. Well, welcome, welcome. It's good to have you here, AJ. If you're new here, welcome. My name's Soulkeeper, and I play adventure games. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Clown. God, I love Gabriel Knight. Such a clown all the time, Gabriel. Put your makeup on, man. Come on, doll yourself up. I gotta see Gabriel Knight in some makeup. Actually, 
I know you're not going to doll it up. Just powder the mirror. He's going to get it. Come on, come on. Oh, oh, we could just walk away. That's cool, too. Uh, here. Let's, let's, let's powder the mirror again. After all, we don't want this to go belly up. We want this to go just, just right. Yeah. Yeah, powder it. I know you look a little rough right now, Gabriel, but don't worry. You're going to look just great after we take care of this guy. Don't worry about him. He's a prima donna anyway. I love this. This is a, such a silly solution to this puzzle. Alright. He's got... Hey. We should probably hide now. Ahem. Hey, now we play the waiting game. There he is. Hi. No reading tonight. No, I only read on Saturday and Sunday, Network Brian. Or I guess Sunday morning and Monday morning. ASMR is just a very small part of what I do. Alright, let's go ahead and tape this guy up. Yeah, this is gonna work. Yeah, this is gonna be good. Yeah, he doesn't see it. He doesn't see it. And... Yeah, we got him. Yeah, ooh. Sorry, bud. Oh. I just want Engelhart too many. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna put himself in the play. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be great. I can't wait to hear this. There we go. Class. Utter class! Fancy! Yeah, buddy! <laughs> the other Titanic! No, no. It's just opera. Mm. It's quite a smorgasbord before him. Grace is keeping an eye on Von Glower. You know, it's a good thing they didn't have to go to the bathroom. Woo! Listen to that! This is a jazz. <laughs> Might as well be. This is avant-garde. Opera, what opera? Probably what it sounded like when the boat was going down, the band was still playing. <laughs> Zombies. Oh, <laughs> uh, boy. <laughs> By this old, what are you talking about? <laughs>
God. Caught! A whiskey music! A whiskey unterhaltung! Bring this Do you all appreciate the culture that I have delivered to you? Do you all feel like you have become oh, a little classier? Mm. Let me rub those feet. Of course, I wouldn't use my hands. Not a fan? Then get taste. If you don't like it, then get taste. This is art. And if you don't like this, once again, get taste. This is for the sophisticated, sophisticated folks in the audience. so much. Oh my god, this is what games were invented for. Makeup though. Uh oh. It's glorious, isn't it, zombies? Don't act like it isn't glorious. This is glorious. <laughs> this is so good. <laughs> Yes. 
You know what is needed? An opera! <laughs> Oh, God. Oh, he's leaving. You ain't going nowhere, Von Glauer. Friedrich, sit yourself down. Uh-oh. Here it comes. Uh-oh. Looks like he's got a pair of... <laughs> that, looks, that looks like me after dinner. <laughs> All right, here we are. We're woofing now. All right, we got a little woofy. We got a little woofy. Uh, God, I don't know. Where, where am I supposed to go? You're not sure what this audience is intended for? Well, me neither. Hey, can I, like, do anything with these doors? Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Alright, so... What door did we just close? Oh. Oh, I guess he just got out of here pretty quickly, didn't he? Uh-oh. Wow, that happened fast. Oh. Gabe's dead. Wow, that went fast. Jeez. Well, of course we're gonna try again. Okay, here we go. Um, yeah. That works. Yeah, we're gonna go all the way to the end, I think. Yeah, and we're just gonna shut this door here. I think. Uh, did we go to the right place? Oh, we did not go at the right place. Oh, yeah, we're donezo. Boy, we're dead already. Where are we? Where are we on the map, anyway? Oh, I'm dead already. Okay. De that's, that's twice I just died. Oh, things are going great, fam. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go this way. And then we're going to like uh turn this door uh, and yeah, that that works, I guess. Oh. Um Yeah, let's go ahead and turn that door. Okay, I guess that's I guess that's good. I don't know if that's good or not. Did 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 we do it right? Did we do it right? I don't know if we did it right, man. I'm just gonna like start closing these doors.
Where, where, where's Von Glauer at? Von Glauer, where are you, man? Uh oh. Well, at least he can't get out, I guess. Am I just gonna die in here? Um, well, we might not die. Okay, that, that kind of works, sort of. Oh. Oh, wait, where's he gonna go? Oh. I... Wow, this puzzle is weird. I am trying my best to understand the puzzle. One. Yeah, where Gabe is having issues, isn't he? Alright, and, uh, yeah, I guess that's what we do. Yeah, let's turn, let's turn around and turn that. Okay, that kind of works. Okay. And now let's go forward again, I think. Okay. Okay. And, God, I guess that's good. I don't know. Which of, the, which of these rooms goes into, like, where we want to go? I think one of those goes into the furnace room. I guess. I, I, I don't know. Like, it's not telling me anything, man. <laughs> Phew. Hello, Bangalore. Where have you gone? Oh, that looks like a room that we might want to close. Here, let's go ahead and close this, I think. Uh, yeah, we'll close that one. Okay, is that good? I wish you would, like, give me a map or something. Can I smell him? Oh, wait, let's smell him. Yeah, let's smell. Where is he at? Oh, there he is. Okay. Oh, that's how we do it? Oh. God, that was weird. It has a smell command all of a sudden. So what if we like go in here and then just like, yeah. Oh, 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 I see what we're doing. What if we just like, okay, we got this closed off. Now I'm in here. I forgot to sniff for trouble, I guess. This is a weird puzzle. This is so bizarre. And I, I'm having trouble telling where I am, sort of. Okay, let's uh, go this way. Yeah, that's, that's the way. Alright, cool. And if we go this way... Yeah, that, okay, it points toward this door, so let's close this door behind us. Bam. Alright, Von Glauer can't do nothing about that one. Ugh. God. <laughs> this puzzle. This puzzle's killing me. Uh, I think we've got Von Glauer trapped over there. <laughs> Gabriel's having trouble opening and closing things with his teeth. So if we just like go in here, I think Von Glover's gonna kill us. Von Glover? I mean, it's the same. It's the same point. It's the same idea. 
Oh, he's gonna get away. He's gonna get away. Yeah, we're just gonna die. Alright, yeah, we're gonna die. Yep, there he goes. Wait, what? Wait, he just went up to the dressing room? <laughs> what was that? It just showed us a shot of the dressing room. <laughs> Well, now that we know how to use the smell command, maybe I can make sense of this. All right, so I I am like right here, and yeah, it is kind of random. All right, all right, we need to like turn right. I will sniff for him. I will sniff, sniff. Okay. Okay, he ain't getting out now. No way, no how, bro. Okay. This is this is good. This is good. We've we've got it closed off for the most part. Now I've got to like close off this room over here. We're gonna we're gonna close off this room. Yes. Yes. So now he can't get away. Now he has to. Now he has to go where I want him to eventually. Yes. Uh oh. We're gonna go over here. Yes. Yes. I've got you. I've got you now. Yes. Yes, I see it now. It is coming all too clearly to me. I think I'm gonna go like over to Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is this is this is a tough nut to crack. This puzzle is so strange. Oh my god, come on, sniff it out there, Gabe! He he's a farting, he's a going, sort of. Yeah, that that works for me. Okay. Let's go over this way. Run, run, move those wolfy legs. Yeah, those hind feet. Drive them forward, buddy. Alright. We've almost got him, baby. We've almost got him. Come on, Gabe, use your newfound wolf powers. All right, all right, here it goes, baby. Yep, one more forward and we're gonna have Von Glauer trapped, I think. Uh-oh, here that or he's gonna have us trapped. Okay, this could be like really, really bad. Um, let me, let me face a different way here. Um, God, I hope that I'm doing this right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, like, up here. I'm gonna close this door, like, right here, and then I'm gonna go up here. Okay, here we go. Uh, am I facing the right way? Yes, I am. Let's close that door, baby. Come on, come on. Don't die, don't die, damn you. Wait, don't die! No, don't die! What do you mean? Why am I dying? What the hell happened? <laughs> I had it figured out, dude. Aww. Aww. Oh, this puzzle. This puzzle is this puzzle is kicking me while I'm down, bro. What? <sighs> All right. All right. All right. Um. God. We got a. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Thanks, AJ. I appreciate that. We have to sniff out his fear. Alright, we're gonna turn right, and we're gonna go down and block the way. We're gonna do it all over again, because that's how we roll, baby. Pull that doorstop out, and let's go. Alright, we got that. That's good. Ugh. Oh my god. Uh, god, he's just gonna get away again. I need to just close the door behind me, man.
Okay, he's, he's over there. He's over there. I, I got him, sort of. I don't know if this is going to work. I feel like I'm doing something wrong. There's like one specific way to solve this. Uh, uh. Okay, let's just go. Okay. I think... Okay, we got... Yeah, let's go down here. Come on, come on, come on! Okay, good, good, good. I think... I think this is how we solve it, dude. I think? God, I don't know. I mean, I think I'm supposed to, like, close all these doors or something, and, and that's how I prevent him from getting away. Oh my god. Knowing Sierra, there's, like, one specific solution that I'm allowed to have, and then I just die. Okay, I guess I just die. God! They only, they only let me have one solution? <laughs> This is, this is very confusing. <laughs> Are they just trying to sell strategy guides? <laughs> it seems like they're just trying to sell strategy guides, man. Come on. All right, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm just, I'm, I am just going to have this guide like right next to me while I'm doing this. Oh my God. All right. I don't remember where I am. Um, okay, I gotta close this door. Okay, we'll close this door now. So we should be good here, I think. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah. Alright, so we're gonna chase Von Glauer around. I see what we're doing, I think. Yeah, we're gonna, like, chase him... Oh, my God. I, God, I, I am really confused by this. Why can't I just cl open the doors, like, both ways or something? <laughs> uh, I, I guess let's, let's close it this way. Um, yeah, let's... Which, which one? Um, yeah, okay, that, that works. Maybe? I guess? I, I don't know. I'm really trying, Gabriel Knight. Help me, man. Um, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna, like... God, I don't know if this is gonna work. I have no idea if this is gonna work. This puzzle is, this puzzle is weird. I know I keep saying it, but it's so weird. I feel like if I click one door wrong, I'm just gonna, I'm just, I'm just done. So we can't like close off too many doors. We gotta leave like one door open at least, I think. So we gotta leave like these doors open and then we go down here and um yeah we we leave that door open okay but if like isn't this door up here can't he just escape through that why doesn't he just escape through that if that's how it is 
I don't know. Alright, let's just go. I'm trying to, like, chase him toward the, the furnace room. It seems like a very obvious puzzle with a very obvious solution, but... You know, sometimes things aren't as obvious as they seem. Ugh. This is frustrating. When they have a puzzle like this that just seems really, really obtuse for, like, no reason. <laughs> I guess Can I just <sighs> Okay, he's he's down there. So I think I think we're in a good place. Let's turn around. Okay. And, oh, oh, we are actually in a really good place now. We can kind of just... We can kind of just chase him this way now. Because he can't get through any of those doors. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I think this is going to work. Alright, so we got like a... We just had to create a line. Where is he at? Okay, he's over there. He's like two steps ahead of us. So now we can chase him into the furnace room, I think, and I think we got him. Come on, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Come on, baby. Hey, he's in He's in the furnace room. All right, cool. Let's save right here. Oh, my God. We did it. We did it. We got him in the furnace room. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. We figured out this weird puzzle. Oh, my God, yes. Yes, yes, here it is. Rawr. Oh, the black one, shoot the black one! Stand back! Stand back! Yeah, don't, don't shoot, don't shoot me, shoot, shoot, shoot him. Other guy. Uh-oh, this looks bad. Grace, you want to maybe do something there? Yeah. Come on, Gracie. Okay, Gracie. Oh, okay, I think we got this. Is she gonna, like, open that there first? God, Lieber looks scared. He looks terrified, and for good reason. Oh, she's... Okay, Von Glow is just gonna let her do it. Come on, baby. Come on. Let's see if we got this. Okay, what now? Um... Wait, what happened? What, 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 what? <laughs> What's it want from me? <laughs> What's it want? <laughs> I don't know what you want! Tell me what you want, Gabriel Knight! I'm just trying to get the wolf! Oh, oh, hey, we're, we're here again. Gracie, do it. Come on, Gracie. Yes, open the furnace. We're going to figure this out, you and me. Um, maybe I need to click on Von Glauer. And wait, okay, yeah, that works. Oh, what do you, what do you want? Do you, wait. Oh, okay. I guess we're gonna. Are we gonna give him a good push? Oh, we we had we can switch between the two. Oh, oh, oh. I I see. I think. Yeah, sure, let's do it. Come on, switch over. I can't attack him by myself. Heh. 
Attack! Attack him by herself. Yeah, and yeah, sure, she's gonna get Von Glauer all by herself. Yeah, cool. Alright, let's see here. Come on, can we pull this off? I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. Here it comes, here it comes, and... What? <laughs> <laughs> he just bangs his head against the furnace. Oh, Gabriel, you nerd. <laughs> and I'm dead again. <laughs> oh, jeez. Lieber looks distraught. Lieber is just all kinds of confused. He doesn't know what's happening. He doesn't know the story of what's going on here. He's just he's just along for the ride. This poor man. I feel bad for Lieber. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Let's try it again. Let's see let's see if I can't attack him by myself. Yeah, I know you can't. Alright, we're switching back to Gabriel. Okay, let's see let's see if we can time this right. Uh, can we time it right? The timing on this is actually really, really tricky. And Oh god! What? I thought the timing on that was good. Oh man, I thought we had it there for a second. Yeah, you 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 messed up there, Lieber. Boy, his that final moment there is probably watching him turn back into Gabriel Knight and realizing, oops. I wish I could save during this fight instead of having to go through all these stages all over again. By but. At least we can just kind of, like, plow through everything. Okay, he's gonna do another leap, and we have to- we have to time this just right. I don't know why the window is so tight. And... Yeah, that always happens. I've only gotten this, like, once. Okay. Man. This section is so tough. Well, we're gonna try it again. We're gonna win. We we got this. Fortunately, we can just skip everything. All right, I can't come on. Him by my don't worry. You don't have to. I'll do all the work for you. And let's see here. Um, any day, really. And here it goes. Move. Yeah, there's like. This seems like a it's, it seems like it should be a very obvious window and it really isn't. <laughs> You're supposed to like click on him or something while he's all stretched out, but then I don't know, you you barely have a window to hit it. And then when he's all stretched out, it's like before he's actually in front of the furnace, which seems like the time to hit him, right? Ah, uh, this section's a little maddening. It's already open. Yeah, I know it's already open. I'm just... I'm clicking fast here, Grace. You'll have to forgive me. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We're gonna get it. Go ahead and leap, Von Glau. We're gonna try it again. We're just gonna keep the mousey, like, right here, and... Why does he keep hitting his head? That should've been good. That should've been good. I clicked on his midsection. What do I have to do to please this thing? What do I have to do to just... Why? Why? Why is that so hard? Is there... What what are people what are what are people doing differently than I, I am? Or does everyone struggle with this part? Now we just gotta wait, and there he goes, there he goes, there he goes. Why? <laughs> I <laughs> I don't understand why I'm not hitting it. <sighs> oh! I can't. feel like I'm I feel like I'm just beating my head against a wall. Come on. 
Like, I know I, I want to click in the middle of the fire there because it seems so obvious. Why does he keep banging his head? Do I have to click on his rear or something? Why did they make this so hard? <laughs> it's such an obvious puzzle with an obvious solution. God, am I going to be here for an hour just clicking on this thing? That's stupid. Why do they do it like this? The window shouldn't be that tight, man. I'm going to look for another guide or something. I, I, I don't think this one knows what it's talking about. Like, I'm looking at this one, and it's telling me that I gotta click on his body or something, or click on his body when it's all stretched out, but it's not working. It's not working. What am I doing wrong, man? Ah, oh, that's annoying. I'll just... okay. It's just, just, it just says, this guy just says, select the black wolf when he jumps. You gotta click on his left foot. Are you being serious right now, or, or are we just trolling? <laughs> God. If you look at Lieber, Von Glauer, or the Furnace, you just end up getting killed. Okay. Okay. Ah, oh, this is ridiculous. You don't know. You don't know. Okay. All these, all these guides don't have anything. They just don't know. <laughs> Why are you even writing an FAQ if you don't know, man? It's already open. I, I can't. I can't believe that all these FAQs are just like, oh, that's great. So we kind of just have to get lucky. What a rotten way to have an ending for the game, where you just can't win. I can't believe how hard this is. Come on, come on, hit him! I'm clicking. I'm clicking on Von Glauer. That should be the end of things. That should be the end right there. You shouldn't be... I shouldn't still be at it. It should be the end of the game, period. Instead... God, Sierra was bad at... Sierra was really, really bad at game design sometimes. This is one of those times where it should be over by now. Like, it makes it hard to enjoy things when it's like this. Like... What's, what's the reason for that? What's the reason for that? He should go in front of the furnace. You should click on him. Gabriel should jump. The end. Like, if they want to do that timing thing, wait for him to go in front of the furnace and knock him in. The end. It's really, really obvious. <laughs> and then they decide to just make it not obvious because, oh, we want to sell strategy guides. We can't just make something simple. I can't. We can't do the obvious thing with our video game design. No, we gotta do something completely obtuse and completely unfair. Good God, dude. What do you gotta do to win? I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I... Come on. Just... just... I'm gonna click on like... I'm just gonna try kick a, clicking on his... I'm gonna try clicking on his foot. I can't. I mean, if that's how, if this is how it is, I might as well try clicking on his foot. Ugh. Be nice if he would shake a leg. Come on. All right, so I click on his butt. And he's just. I click. I click on that. He just bangs against the wall again. This is like some of the worst design I think I have ever seen. 
<laughs> it's astoundingly bad. Earth, earth rockingly bad. <laughs> it's already. I can't. Like, it's so bad. What are these people. What business do these people who made this have making video games? Click the wolf immediately when he jumps. That that's what it is? You have to click the wolf immediately when he jumps? You know, if that's how it is, they could have given you a hint. No, they have to sell their strategy, guys. What am I saying? Alright, I guess alright, let's try it. Come on, come on. Zombies. Um. That was dumb. That's that's the solution. That's dumb. <laughs> that's 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 a little that that. Mm. All right. All right. All right. Jesus Christ! Oh my God! Oh, it's metal! Oh, that one right. Uh -huh. Oh, oh, that was that was. Ooh. God about that part. Oh my God! Lieber looking at that, looking and saying to himself. I wish I hadn't seen that. I'm going back to school soon. It's all arranged. Don't do that. You didn't even want me on this case. You came up so quickly. <sighs> Give me a break. Fine, I wanted you safe in America, so sue me. It won't happen again. <laughs> it won't. Yeah, it's all over now, and I know how to beat it finally. I can't believe that was the solution. <laughs> What's Von Glauer really like? I liked him. Haven't you ever wished you could just follow your instincts? Hmm. Don't we all, okay? For the moment. Yes. Oh. That was Von Glauer. Von Glauer? Was that pit of bodies? Ludwig's suicide. There's always a price, Gabriel. Don't you know that by now? What you just said... I made my choice, Gracie. ...is one of the most insanely idiotic so things I have ever heard. Do you know why? At no point <laughs> in your rambling, incoherent response... I guess when it comes right ...were you down, even close to anything that could be considered a rational I thought. I like that. Everyone in this room is now dumber. For having listened to it, I don't want to be I like award that, you Gracie. no points, and may God have mercy Thanks, on Andrews. your soul. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's good stuff, man. Oh, well, at least I know how to beat Gabriel at night too now. Thanks, zombies. I appreciate it. They won't stop testing you, you know. Think it easy, though. Don't you think, Gracie? No, it won't. Mr. Schottenjaeger. Don't you think? <laughs> 